is coming our way, Lauren. Thank you. Well, the Colorado Avalanche Information Center is always looking for ways to keep Coloradans safe as they head out into the backcountry. And for their latest mission, they turn to a few students at Colorado Mountain College in Leadville. Your reporter, the Mountain Spencer Wilson, caught up with a professor. One of the most important things the Colorado Avalanche Information Center does is try to get people to their website where they have potentially life-saving information for anyone playing out here in the backcountry of Colorado. The second important thing they need to do is make sure that people understand the data on their website. And that's where the Accident Explorer comes in. Uh, we can also see that the majority of these accidents over the last five years are of the soft slab type. It's the same data that the website has always had, but in an easier to understand format, put together from scratch by Dr. Dara Seidel and her students, which was not easy work. Oh, it was hard. Yes. <laughs> yes. So this is certainly the, the most intense coding production that my students and I have put together and so there was a lot of learning involved. The page catalogs fatal avalanche accidents, noting what the person was doing when it happened, the type of avalanche, the destructive level, where it was, and the size of the avalanche. The CAIC said this new version of the data will make it easier for everyone to figure out patterns and mitigate risk. This allows people to really do some of the exploration for themselves. It's helping us really understand that this is something that's not just for people living in Leadville, for people living in the mountains, but for anybody who is traveling to, into the backcountry. As for what's next, CAIC said it's not done yet with new programs. In the, the kitchen getting baked right now, and uh, as soon as they're ready, we'll roll them out so you can take a look at them. If you're looking at that Accident Explorer on the CAIC webpage, you'll notice there are no fatal accidents this year so far, which is great news. But the CAIC did say that with these storms coming up, the avalanche danger could rise, so it's something you want to keep care to watch for. In Leadville, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first. And Spencer covers Colorado's high country like no one else. He lives in Summit County. We sure hope you'll reach out to him through CBSColorado.com. You can always call him and leave him your story ideas at our tip line.